2,000, go ahead, one more time. Yeah, it's 2,475 square feet unit. Um, the rain include uh, water, trash, and common area maintenance. Mm -hmm. uh, you only pay for electricity. Mm -hmm. And the rent monthly will be, give me one second. Uh, you'll be looking at 4,125 a month. 4,100 is price. Welcome back to another video with Shredder Tempter about the plastics and transfers. And as you just saw, mm -hmm. we are here at another location. We've actually, we haven't filmed all day. It's been really bad raining, but we're looking at like five different locations for our new showroom. So that's what Shelly's over there doing. She's talking about location here. As you guys can look inside, this one does need a lot of work. It's about 2,400 square feet, but it has a nice little reception area that you would be able to come into. It actually used to be a veterinarian place, and then. It has all of that room in the back to where we would put the printers and all of the other finishing hardware that goes with a print shop so that you would be able to come. You would be able to come directly to us. You would be able to demo every printer that we have, all the Mamaki uh, printers that we will be holding. You will be able to see it, touch it, see it print and everything. And then you'll be able to purchase right from us right here. And then you'll get your printer right to you. So that's what we're doing. We're looking for a showroom. So ew, look at the book. <laughs> yeah, we're looking for a showroom. So just come hang along with us as we uh, stop by a few more places and uh, show you how to grow your business in this DTF space. So as you can see, it's super raining. She's over there on the phone with the guy getting the information. It is raining, but no matter what, you still gotta do what you gotta do. Woo. Hey, how you doing? Yeah. All right, Shelly's over there <coughs> talking to somebody, talking to the real estate agent. We are here at this place. Again, they, if this is open, I'll widen out. This place is open right here, this unit, and then all of those units are right open right there we're right here by the water and then we have 105 right here across the street from over there with water as well so again everything that we're looking for and it's brand new it's brand new denny's brand new everything everything that we're looking for we're looking to have curb appeal even though we are selling printers and stuff like that oh this one's open too yeah it's a decent size yeah they all look like 1900 2000 square feet or maybe even more but again, our goal, our goal for this entire showroom is to, the Mamaki showrooms are gorgeous. They're very, they were very thought out and we want to mimic that as well for Flash Printing Depot. So that this way, whenever you come to us, you have a beautiful experience checking out the printers and everything else that we have. That one's a little smaller? Okay, so let's look inside of this one. Yeah, this one's a little smaller. I think it's, as long, no, I think it'll do everything that we need. So we want printers. We'll have different printers lined up, all of the different options out there for you guys. So we will have printers, DTF printers, we will have lasers, hopefully, and we will definitely have finishing equipment. Finishing equipment, things like those cutters, those um, Apex cutters that you've seen us film from Cutworks. We want to have everything all in one spot, because usually right now, each dealer is kind of separated or not dealer, not every dealer has everything that you're looking for. We're trying to be a one-stop shop for you to be able to come to us, our first showroom, check out everything that we have, and then, you know, hopefully see it work, demo it out for you, and then you purchase from there. That's our goal. I do like the stuff. So as you guys can see, the, what they would do is every door, every unit, they would split up or they would probably lease you out the entire thing. You know, they could lease out the entire thing, but this is something that we're looking for. Again, it's in a great location. Not that we necessarily need foot traffic. That's not something that we're looking for. You will have to, you will be able to stop by and come inside, but mostly everything will be due. Everything will go through appointment, appointment only. You have to be, uh, you have to set up an appointment. All right, so we are at this more industrial flex type facility. It's called the uh, Tall Pines here in Con Conroe. Or maybe that's just the name of the place, Tall Pine Storage, but, and then this is the realtor. But this is, huh? Yeah, this is a good size. This would be perfect. Now, a lot of them do come with the, a lot of them are flex units. So they will come with the garage attached to it. Like a lot of these units, they have a garage attached to it. This specific unit does not have the garage attached to it, but there's a lot open, like that one down there and a few other ones, they're vacant. So we're definitely gonna be looking at those as well. 
because I'm a big fan of having that flex option with the garage and then the closed in space as well. It's going to be very hard to run a printer in a garage if the if the climate on something like this on something like today is really bad. You're going to have a lot of humidity in the air with the moisture. So you're not going to want to run your printer in a garage or something open like that. But a unit that's closed like this would be perfect. Great space. We, are, we would be able to put a lot of things. Got that industrial look because um, the Mamaki in Dallas has like an industrial look on the outside. So we would kind of be matching that as well versus more of a retail location. This is more of that flex location. I like the way it looks again. Great curb appeal. We're on 105. So great parking as well. A lot of parking. You'd be able to come in and knock everything out. Come in and look at your printer. What do you think, babe? I like it. You like it? Yeah. This one, and do you want to look at the other ones or the flex spots? All the other flex spots that they got open. We don't have to. I'm just saying. Did I was just. Any other open? Yeah, a lot of these are open. Not all of these suites. If they don't have a name on the door, then it's open. Because it doesn't have things on the door. No, yeah, because they put the name on the door to let you know. I don't. This one, I think, is because it's so big. But I guess we'll just call and see. We got the information.